Yes, people, welcome to Scott's Book Steve for another uh, watch along today. Um, welcome everybody to the channel. Make sure if you haven't already hit the like button, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Thanks for redirect from Lewis. We just did the Shameless FC show. Um, I got to turn the game on, obviously. But uh, yeah, um, doing Udinese versus Inter Milan today. I was really debating if I wanted to do um, the League 2 game, but. I was like, fuck it, we'll do Inter Milan. I like watching I, I, I like watching them play. So I might do a league to watch along, though. I think there's Saint-Étienne and Bordeaux have a game coming up that I really want to check out. But, yeah, so let's just get right into uh, the starting 11s for both teams. Uh, Okoye in goal, a uh, Nigerian goalkeeper, for Ud uh, Udinese, Nahua and Perez. Uh, Yasko B uh, sorry, not Yasko B uh, Biol. Uh, I forget his name. Uh, Yaka, Yaka Biol, uh, Thomas Christensen at uh, uh, right, uh, left center back. Usually they have um, Ferreira there. Usually they do have that Portuguese guy Ferreira there. Um, they do have Kingsley Abuze at uh, right uh, right wing back. Um, or Oyer uh, Zaraga in midfield, Spanish midfielder. Uh, Wallace in midfield, like always. Lazar Samardzic, who's a really decent player. Um, Hassan Kamara at left wing back. Uh, Roberta Pereira and Florian Tovan, World Cup winning Florian Tovan, formerly of Olympique de Marseille, Newcastle, Tigres as well. Um, so, yeah, decent lineup here for Udinese. I think that I, I would rather be, I would, you know, I personally out of their bench, I think Joao Ferreira gets in. And I want to see more of Festi Abosele, but um, I do think Okoye might be better at this point in time in goal for Udinese than. Um, uh, uh, Silvestri. So, but yeah, decent line for Udinese. They've got um, they've got more to play for, arguably, than Inter. In terms of Inter have the league, like they would have to lose eight of their games, and Milan would have to win. But you know, it's 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 coming up where it's like an eleven point gap. They've lost once. They would have to draw, and um, nah, yeah, yeah. Udinese playing a three six one in it. <laughs> <laughs> they kind of are. I mean, it's a three-five-two basically because Roberto Pereira. Um, so yeah, it is what it is. But yeah, this is what you Udinese usually they always go with a three-five, three-five-two, three-five-one-one. However you want to really look at it. So, um, but yeah, that's Udinese's lineup. Like I said, on the bench for them, Marco Silvestri. That's a decent back goalkeeper. Goalkeeper to have Isaac Success, formerly of Watford. I think he's on loan from Watford. Um, Festi Abelcelli, like I said, I really like the kid. Um, but yeah, uh, Jordan Zamora as well. So they got like a decent sub here and there, but they've got a relegation battle. Like I said, they are only two points clear of Frosinone in that final relegation spot in 18th. Ellis Verona, Empoli, one and two points also behind. So Udinese, if they can scrap to a draw here, bro. They need a bad. They need a bad. So, um, yeah, that's what Udinese are kind of playing for. For Inter Milan, Jan Sommer is in goal. Uh, Benjamin Pavard, um, Francesco Acerbi, and Carlos Augusto is the back three. Um, then you've got a midfield five of Denzel Dumfries, Nicola Varela, Hakan Chalanoglu, Enrique Mkhitaryan, and Federico Di Marco. Um, and then a front two of uh, Lautaro Martinez and Marcus Turam. So that's pretty decent. That is pretty decent. So, yeah. Um, look, I'm expecting an Udinese. Or sorry, I'm expecting not an Udinese win. I'm going with a probably a 3-1. I'll go 3-1 Inter, Inter Milan win, to be honest. I'll go 3-1. Uh, but Udinese will scrap. And they can play some nice football. Their problem is the final touch. The final touch and the final ball, final pass, whatever it is from Udinese is always lacking for some reason. It's always lacking. So Inter been killing it this year. So, but yeah, big up everybody inside. Your French is starting to do something strange to me. Jesus Christ. What's good, Chris? But yeah, up the likes, people, man, damn. Let's go. Let's go. Up the likes. Up the likes. We got 51 people in here. 25 likes. 25 likes. Let's start small. Let's start small. I'm not asking for much here, people. I'm starting. You know what I'm saying? Man don't want to see Sosuolo relegated. They must survive. Now, Sosuolo are down, bro. 
They don't. They. They. No, Domenico Berardi. They're fucked, man. I'm sorry. So swallow. So swallow got. They got too much to overcome. To be honest, they've they've been playing poor. You know, can't can't beat Salernitana away. Um. Uh, yeah. They screwed. They screwed. I'm sorry for any Sassuolo believers out there. But they had a good run in Serie A, made Europe, made the fucking Europa League, played Athletic Bilbao and or Athletic Club. So yeah, it's 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 over, bro. It's over. You want small Chelsea Europe hopes now? That's small. Yeah, it is. That's facts. That's facts. But yeah. Decent lineup out here. And then on the bench for Inter Milan, you've got Stefano Sensi, Marco Arnautovic, Rafael Di Gennaro, who's a third-choice goalkeeper, Davi Klassen, who's rubbish. Fratesi is decent, but he's not had the season um, uh, that some people maybe thought he would. Um, what's it called? Um, what we got here? Uh, do, 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 do. Oops. The fuck, come on. There we go. Yeah, David David Fratesi. Tejan Buchanan should be starting over Denzel Dumfries. That's the one thing I would say. Um, because I don't really rate Denzel Dumfries. He's too clunky on the ball. Uh, he's he's declined, man. He's definitely declined. Christian Aslani is a good sub. Biseka should also be starting, I think, over Pavard. Um, Matteo Darmian um as well can sometimes play on the right for Inter. So He's a, he's, a, he's a decent sub to have. Alexander Stankovic. Alexis Sanchez is rubbish, but he can get some goals, I guess. And Emil Adoro, another backup goalkeeper. So they are missing Bastoni. They are, miss, they are, miss, they are missing Alessandro Bastoni, who's obviously one of the better center backs in the, in, the, in the world, honestly. One of the better center backs in the world. So, yeah, to be honest, though, yeah, Udinese, they've, they've, been, um, they, they've not been good this season. But yeah, Inter Milan, 69% win probability. Um, and also, Inter have won five of their last six Serie A matches against Udinese with only one loss, scoring almost triple the number of goals they've conceded in this time, 17-6. to six. They've outscored them in the past six games. So it's not been close at all between these two teams. Inter have dominated um, per usual. Um, so, yeah, uh, in the last 12 Serie A matches against Inter, Udinese have failed to find the net on eight occasions, including the most recent match against the Nerazzurri, a 4-0 defeat um, in December 9th when they played at the San Siro. So, yeah, they're kind of fucked, bro. I can't lie, they just fucked out here. Um, Udinese won their last Serie A home match against Inter, 3-1 in September 18th of 2022. You could avoid defeat in back-to-back -back home games against the Nerazzurri for the first time since the period between 06 and 08 until uh, while they could win two home meetings in a row for the first time since 2000 under Luigi Di Cagno. Udinese have never repeated the same result twice in a row in their last nine Serie A matches. Two wins, four draws, three losses. Drawing in their most recent game, which is 1-1. Um, Inter have won 11 of their last 12 Serie A matches in 2024, with the only exception being the draw on March 17th against Napoli at the, at the San Siro, conceding only six goals and only one of those in the first half. So February 10th, yeah, it was February 10th at Roma. So, yeah. they uh, the Inter Milan... Take care of business in the first half. They don't concede goals. Um, they're a remarkable side. Um, but yeah, definitely a bit disappointing this year not to go a little bit farther in the champs. But um, yeah, they're a really good side to enter. But yeah, if you haven't already, people hit the like button, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Who do I think is getting top four? I think Bologna are here to stay. I think Bologna will get fourth place. Um. I think Juve will just barely hold on. They'll just barely hold on, I think. So. Um, but yeah, people, that's what we got going on. So. Yeah, kickoff about five minutes away. But yeah, let me know, people, what we got. 
Any questions? Yeah, Alexis Central still playing. Yay, we'll play Canada. Big up Saski Gooner as well. Arsenal and Newcastle, big away wins. Yeah, facts, facts. But yeah, Deja Buchanan, I want to see him playing more for them. I think that would be that'd be what I would do at least, but that's what it is really. But yeah, people, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. Libertadores this week. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can do any watch-alongs. I'm not sure yet. I might be able to, might not. I don't know. But yeah, Inter got their orange shirt on. I really like that orange shirt, to be fair. Big up next. Big up next. Udinese doesn't even have one Italian in their starting 11. Yeah, actually, if you look at it. So you've got uh, two Nigerians. Wallace is Brazilian, a Spaniard, Samardzic, Christensen is Danish, Nahuan, uh, Nahuan Perez is Argentinian, Roberto Pereira is Brazilian, Tovan is French, Samardzic is um, not Bosnian, not Serbian either. What the hell is Samardzic? Yeah, he's Serbian. Right. But yeah. Game about to start here. Oh, you're an Inter fan. Big up next. Big up, Broski. But uh, yeah, so. Should be pretty straightforward for Inter tonight, but Udinese might make it tricky. Might make it tricky. Where are you based, Steve? In New Hampshire. New Hampshire. So, But I was born in Chicago. Born in Chicago. So. Oh. Hey. What the fuck? We have people. We're about to start here. Oh, you'll be. Oh, wow. Nice. Nice. Word. Oh, you live in Toronto. Fairs. Fairs. Hold on. I'm going to just put this up on my Twitter. Two seconds, people. Gustavo Hammer just reminded me of yesterday. My day has been ruined. It's uh, Gustavo Hammer, man. My baller. My baller. You heard? My fucking baller. My ball, man. Big up, Ratish. Big up, Steve. Cody Rhodes finished his story. Yeah, I heard about that. Heard about that. I don't really watch WWE like that. Hockey's fine. Yeah, I like hockey. I like hockey. Hey, I'm doing great, AJ, bro. What about you? I'm doing good, bro. Um, How did you fall in love with European football? World Cup 2014, bro. World Cup 2014. That's how I got into football. Really. So, I was I was just literally looking for something to watch on TV and was like, "I right, word." I was like, "I right, word." But yeah, we have started. People, we have kicked off at Udinese. I gotta open up the YouTube tab. Actually, we kicked off yet? No. Damn, if, if Inter Milan didn't lose to Sassuolo, they'd be unbeaten. Hey, we just kicked off here, people. 
Just kicked off, people. Just kicked off. Yeah, three five one one. That's interesting. That's interesting. Uh. Steve versus Cody Rhodes, bro. I don't. No thanks. Yeah, I just noticed the 16 out of 10. <laughs> uh, yeah, shout out Gustavo Hammer, man. Hammer time. Let's go. Let's go. Bring Gustavo Hammer to Lazio. Bring him to Newcastle. Let's go. Sign me up, man. Uh, here's a Jacobio. Trying to find Tovan over the top. It's headed out by Benjamin Pavard. There's Gabriel Chofi. Hammer does have a shot. He's a he has an excellent strike from outside of the box. Excellent technique. Ooh, that's a foul. That's a foul. Yeah, I like Gustavo Hammer, man. Decent player. He's a decent player, man. Damn, Wallace pushing up here. Burrell. A Cherby. Pavard into with kind of a four at the book four at the back look right now. Place to the left. Rica Di Marco. Augusto. Yeah, they basically pay him with four at the back enter. Four, two, three, one. Nah, 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 Sebastian, nah. Forza enter. Nah, man. AC Milan, y'all can hold that. Augusto, Federico Di Marco, Mikitarian, a Cherby over to Benjamin Pavard, Barella, Dumfries. Christensen does a good job of just harassing, uh, what's it called? Harassing him there, in it? Ah, so Lorenzo Luca is suspended. That's why he isn't playing or he's not on the bench. He's suspended. Okay, fairs. Good run here. Dumfries, Pavard, Barella, Barella, DiMarco, Dumfries, block. Yeah, make sure you hit the like button, people. Subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Hope everybody's doing good. Carlos Augusto trying to chase him behind. Federico DiMarco. That's a poor ball. 
That's a poor ball. Five minutes in, people still no, no. Interesting. Over at Augusto's kind of cutting inside. DeMarco. Hmm. Yeah, big up everybody inside. Hope everybody's doing all right. Wallace. Chalinoglu. Mikatarian. Federico DiMarco. DiMarco back to Mikatarian. Udinese midfield getting some joy against them. That's a soft foul. That's a soft ass foul. That's soft, bro. I'm sorry. That's soft as hell. Oh, hello, Versal Master. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put that game on. Hatter? Lotaro? Nope. Got a lot of Inter fans at the game. A lot of Inter fans. Jesus Christ. Why is nobody marking Lotaro Martinez in the box? That's shite defending. That's crazy. That's crazy, yo. That's crazy. DeMarco in to get a throw in out of it, it looks like. Sorry, throw in for Udinese. My apologies. Throw in for Udinese. Here's Beal. No Juan Perez. Perez. Trying to find Tovan in behind. Tovan doing some back to goal. Pereira. Yeah, it's a 3 5 2, basically. Yeah, true. Possibly, yeah. But yeah, big up Marcus. Yes, he definitely is going to stay at Inter. Yes, definitely. I would love him at uh, Bayern mentioned that. would absolutely love him. I don't know what to do for Bayern's manager, bro, because I got, I got a lot of boxes you need to tick. Mkhitaryan. No, I don't want Poch at Bayern München. Thank you, though. Poch's next job is gonna be a. It's not gonna be. It's not gonna be anything good. Mkhitaryan has a teardrop pass over to DiMarco on the left. DiMarco blocked by it. Uh, it, it Mkhitaryan. Marco, DiMarco run into the box, wants a penalty. He's a bue, good defending. What's our logic? What's good, broski? Grand Potter is available. He, no, I'm not taking Grand Potter at Bayern either. Oh, my Lord. Bro. Corner, Chalanoglu kicks out. DiMarco strike. DiMarco again. Nope, wide left. Wide left. 
That's a really, really good corner from Cholanoglu. He's been one of the best midfielders in Europe this season. He's been unbelievable. Like, seriously. Yeah, I would take Hansi Flick back. 100%. No foul. VAR checked it. Oh, close. Wallace. Yaka Beal. Beal. Tovan trying to hold it up. See, they need someone. They needed Lorenzo Luca today, man. But he got a yellow in the last game. They needed Lorenzo Luca. Because Tovan doesn't have that back to goal strength. Dumfries. Chalanoglu. No. Throw that's a foul. That's a foul. No spoilers, people. Facts. Yeah, no spoilers. It's not the end of the world if you know. What's your thoughts on the Fenerbahce stuff versus Galatasaray? Bro, it's crazy out here. Of course, who wouldn't want Jurgen Klopp? Of course, man. That's just common sense, isn't it? That's what I want at Bayern, but I don't think it'll happen. Yeah, my thoughts on the Fenerbahce and Galatasaray stuff? Yeah, I mean, if Fenerbahce feel like they've been... um. I just don't know why they showed up for the game in the first place. Like, just don't show up for the game. I don't know. What's up, Adam? Pick up Adam in the chat. Yeah, Turkey. Turkey is crazy, bro. I love it. I love it. Man, they are they are hardcore passionate and sometimes too passionate about their footy, man. Sometimes I am too. Sometimes I'm way too passionate about my footy but yeah people still no no about 12 minutes in 13 that's a terrible pass from a cherby roberta pereira roberta pereira pereira that's a poor strike that's a really poor strike nah i haven't seen it he probably wouldn't. Uh, Tiago Malta will go to Juve. Definitely Juventus. Turam. Yeah, I haven't seen the slower clips. Dumfries. Uh, oh, are you talking about this game? Let me check for you. Let me check. Yeah, facts. That would have ended in chaos. I agree. I agree. Here's Lazar Samardzic. Summers it shot block Barella. Nah, I don't think CR7 or Messi will go into management. Mikatarian Latara Martinez shot block. Easy save. Easy save.
Oh, wow. I didn't hear about that. That's crazy, yo. Man, we still got dumbass racist people in 2024. Sadly, we always will have racist people. Unfortunately, you can't stop racism as much as people want to. Like, it's a, the idea is phen phenomenal, obviously. Like, all of us, nobody want to see racism. But yeah, you can't ever get rid of it. There's always going to be a minority of people just like that. It's all about education. Cherby poor pass. Still known, though. Yeah, I think two Ram will score as well. I agree. I agree. Augusto, DiMarco, Turam, very close, very close from Turam, very close. Malta under Juve would cook, need Juve to get back on top in European chip, because they would be more competitive. Yeah, they're going to take a few years, though, to be competitive again, I think, in, in the champs. Because even when they were really good, you know. Barella. Mikatarian, or sorry, Chalnoglu. Di Marco, Francesco Acerbi. Acerbi now has more misplaced passes than racism allegations. <laughs> Jesus. That's a good ball. That's a great through ball. Chao Noglu. Very close. Good goalkeeping from Okoye. Good goalkeeping, Okoye. Very good run. Ah, Juarez beat San Luis. Ferris, Ferris. Samardzic get draws a foul there. Samardzic. Here's Jakob Biel. Christensen. Back to Biel. Biel. Now Juan Perez. Jakob Biel. That's a good ball. Uh, pickpocketed there. Wallace. Wallace pickpocketed though. Turam. Chalanoglu. Ooh, Chalanoglu. That's close. Ooh. 
That's close. Um, do you think Inter Milan, uh, they're not that impressive since the Champions League elimination? Yeah, they haven't been playing their best football lately, but um, that's a really good save, Okoye. That's a really good save. Really good save, Maduka Okoye. Really good save. But they they have such a big lead. Here's a corner for Inter. Di Marco. Not a great corner, but still retained by Inter. That's a bad pass from Mikatarian. Perez. Perez with the poor pass. What's up, Ryan G? Hope you're doing good, Ryan. Pavard. Here's Francesco Cherby. Mkhitaryan. Exactly, Alexander. They should have finished off at Tidico Madrid when they had their chance to. That's what I'm saying. I actually haven't seen it yet. I haven't seen it yet. I'll check out the highlights, though. Augusto. Augusto. Acherbi. Barella. Yeah, you could get you could get through to the semis. Yeah, I hope you beat Roma. I hope that AC Milan beat fucking um. Uh, what's it called? Pavard. The link you sent me. No, I'll send it to you though. Hold on, Chalanoglu shot. Nope. Give me two seconds, uh, Ryan. Okoye, Betty DiMarco. Summerzich. What's good, Brick Cat Export Agenda? What's good, bro? Yeah. I think you'll beat Roma. But I'm just worried about the management head to head, bro. I'm worried about that. I think they have a chance. I think they have a chance, definitely. Marco, nope. Not Juan Perez. Corner. Oh, nice. Nice. Chalanoglu corner, nope. DiMarco, no. Nope. 
one up. Neuhaus, Kone, Elvade. Yeah, they're decent players. Where would Lazio finish in the Prem? 12th. Maybe. Like, we're shit, bro. Barella? Turam? 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 Pat has good last minute clearance. Foul. Handball on Turam in his own box. Huh. Yes. <laughs> yeah, they would. I think so. Probably third place. That's a poor pass. No worries, AJ, bro. No worries. Chalanoglu. Barella. Lotaro Martinez. Pavard. Bastoni injured? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he injured. Pick up Milan Labs. To be fair, um, to be fair, I don't think um, Udinese have been playing that bad today. Inter haven't been at the races so far, to be honest. Trying to play Udinese just don't have an outlet, bro. Oh, wow. Mikatarian. Jesus Christ. He's Mikatarian. Lotaro Martinez. Lotaro? Lotaro? Pass? So oh, what a good strike, Sean oh, Uncle. Good save. Good save. What a good strike from Sean Uncle. Oh, DeMarco header. Oh, Jesus. Damn. Now, Martinez is playing. Lotaro Martinez is playing. Fox. They got banned on my bro as well. That's a good save. Good save. Headed up by Biol. Lotaro Martinez. Trying to get it through. Nothing there. Oh. 
No. I've only fucked one girl. No. She wasn't fat. Interesting question. <laughs> That's uh, poor. 31 minutes in, people still know, no. Yeah, facts. Yeah, I agree with this, Adam. I agree with this. Oh, Jesus Christ. Did it unplug? No, it's still plugged in. Still plugged in. But yeah, people, still no, no here. Who didn't say an eater? I have no idea, Rinkatic. Well, I'll answer the question. I don't care. Samardzic? Block? Ooh, Samardzic. Stra. He accidentally hit um he accidentally hit him in the face. At Chal and all glue. Hey man, just go for it. Um are you a full timer now, or what do you work with? No, I'm not full time on YouTube. Hell no, hell no, am I full time on YouTube, bro? That's the ideal situation. That would be sick, you know what I'm saying? But nah, nah, man. No, no, no. No, but that's the idea, bro. Going full time on YouTube? Absolutely. John Oglu. How many subs till you go full time? Bro, it's not a matter of subs. It's a matter of like. I don't even know. I, bro, I am probably at 1% of what I need to do to become full time. 1%. You put in 16 hours on Saturday, practically full time. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But you know what that, you know, okay, so you know what this is. You know what this is. I keep fucking dropping this. I keep fidgeting with it. And I'm going to continue to fidget with the earbud. You know what I'm saying? Bro, I put in 16 hours on Saturday because that's my off day of work. And none of my friends could hang out on Saturday. So I was like, I right, we going to do streams all day. And actually, this Saturday, we've got a bit of a madness coming up. And Friday as well. Friday, Friday, I'm planning on doing three watch alongs. Hertha, Hertha BSC, Hertha Berlin versus Hansa Rostock at 12:30. Then it's Lazio Salernitana. Then I'm gonna do Deportivo Cali versus America di Cali in uh, a Colombian. Uh, it's a derby game, big, big, big game in Colombia. So I'll do that at nine o'clock. On um, yeah. Yeah, man. It's uh, and watch time, bro. Watch time as well. But yeah, so I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna try to do at least two watch alongs on 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 Friday. I will do two. We'll see if I go out or do something on um um what's it called? We'll see if I do something on um if I do the Colombian game. Gusto, DiMarco, good cross, headed out. Udinese are defending pretty well here. They're defending well here. Pavard. I need to see more of Barella. I, I'm going to be so real, bro. I need to see more of Barella in this game. 
yeah, I'll be watching Copa America 100%. But yeah, on Saturday as well. So I've got, I'm going to do, I've got seven watch alongs I think I'm going to try to do. I'll do Europa League with Northside. Yeah, Benfica, Olympique de Marseille on Thursday. And Nor and um, Lawless from Sarcasm City TV, my brother, he'll be on there. Don't freeze. Decent cross. Saddle by Lataro. Cross. Nope. Away by Wallace. Very well done. Augusto. Nope. Oh, Udinese looking decent here defensively. But, um, yeah. So I've got, let's see. Let me count this out. So I'm going to do Newcastle Tottenham. If I have time, may I jump on for a bit on Saturday? Yeah. Renketic, do you follow me on Instagram or Twitter or anything? Let me know because I could I could DM you. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, Newcastle Tottenham. I'm doing that game on Saturday. Then I'm doing Strasbourg versus Stade Ram at 11. Then I'm doing Porto versus Famila Sao. So that's three. Then I'm doing Cadiz versus, Bar versus Barcelona. That's four. Then I'm doing Internacional uh, versus Bahia in the Brazilian League. Then I'm doing CF Montreal versus FC Cincinnati. That's six. And then I'm going to do Real Salt Lake versus Columbus Crew or Vancouver Whitecaps versus LA Galaxy. So, yeah, they're fucked, bro. So, uh, I want, bro, I hope we win. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, Rinkatic, just send me a message and, and let me know which game you want to hop on for. On Saturday. I don't mind. I don't mind. Yeah, if you haven't already, people, what do we have for likes? We have 30 likes. Get to 35, people. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. If you haven't hit the like button already, let's go. DiMarco. John Oglu. Barella. Pick up Saski Gooner. DiMarco! Trying to... Is a shot cross, a shross. Work rate, facts. No, I didn't watch WrestleMania yesterday. I'll watch it sometimes, like maybe once a year, maybe. My favorite MLS team is uh, Mon uh, Montreal, CF Montreal. Because I'm four hours away from their stadium, four hours from Montreal. One of my favorite places to go on, like, little trips to. Love Montreal. Uh oh that's a bad giveaway from Chalanoglu. Hassan Kamara, it's a decent pass. Roberto Pereira. Settled, kind of, by Tovan. Samarzic. Wait, someone said, wait, whoa, it's a goal! It's a goal! Goal! What did it answer? 1 0 up! What? What was that? It's a goal! And it's a fluky one, if anything. Summer Zitch. So, this is a, this looks like some horrible miscommunication. This looks like some horrible miscommunication here. From Inter's defense. The Chalanoglu pass was very poor. Kamara intercepts it. He passes it over to Pereira. Pereira crosses it over to Samardzic. Doesn't settle it well. But then he takes it. Drifts. Cuts inside. Takes a shot. And Summer assumes... Oh, Augusto, it took a deflection. Oh, my God. It's one nothing Udinese, people. 
Oh, Internazionale, you in the woods, G. You in the woods, my G. Hey, Footy Judge Mo. Hey, Footy Judge Mo, what you doing, man? What the fuck was that goal? Inter are losing one nothing, you know. Wow. They've been poor this half. Inter Milan been shit this game, I can't lie. They have, they've they've tested a Koye maybe once or twice, but this five in the midfield is really, really nullifying Inter. They don't have options to pass. They don't have free runners picking up easy spots. Like, oh, that's a beautiful ball, though. Now they could have some outnumbered. Udinese still have five in defense. DeMarco, Lotaro, what a good save, Lacoye. What a good save. That's a great header. Oh, my God. That's a great save. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. John Oglu, header from Doomfries. That's wide right. Inter woken up here since the goal went in. Sad part is even if us at AC Milan win every Serie A game, Inter might have too many points. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's too late, you would think. Inter would have to lose their next game and their next game and their next game and their next game. And you'd have to win out. But I still expect the Inter to pick up the three points. But they haven't played well tonight. Had three decent chances, but Okoye has had a uh, good job. McCoy has done a good, good job in that her uh, thingy. Wow. Crazy. Oriental Vaughn. Ooh. Ooh, uh-oh. Inzaghi is fucking livid, you know. Turam? Wow. Three minutes added on, people. Three minutes. Lazaro Martinez, this is better for me. Today. They're moving it a bit quicker. Roberto Pereira. Pereira. Oh, my God. Wow, Zaraga. Very nice. That's a foul. That's a foul. Wow. Who didn't answer, man?
They couldn't beat Sosuolo last week. Wow. Wow. Uh, no, but I think Valencia will give them a good game. I don't think Valencia have enough firepower or overall quality. I like a lot of their players. Javi Guerra, Hugo Duro. I like Dimitri Falkier. I like their Turkish center back, Ozjakar. I love Georgi Mamertes, really. I, 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 I do like their right back, the Portuguese kid, Thierry Correa. I like him. I like um, Jose Gaia. I like Pepe Lu. Uh, I like your Ramchuk, but that's not a quality enough to beat Inter Milan in, in like a two-legged thing. I don't think so. Yeah, Inter are losing, yeah. But no, Valencia got, not, Valencia got a nice little neat team. They did give a good game against Real Madrid and Barca at home. They did. They did. They got, they got a, a draw. They drew with them twice in it. Oh, bear, they got bare knuckle boxing on BN Sports. That's crazy, yo. Oh, damn. I Show Speed got RKO'd by Randy Orton. Nice. Good on you, Randy Orton. Good job. You're doing the Lord's work out here. Yeah, half time coming up here in a few seconds, people. I don't know why it's not on DirecTV or Xfinity, to be fair. I don't know. Have time, people. Wow. 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 Damn. Who didn't say beating Inter Milan, you know? Hey, footy judge Mo. What are we doing here, man? What are we doing here? What are we doing here? What are we doing here, bro? It ain't looking good for you, Chief. It ain't looking good for you, Chief. Big up, Mass Channel. I, yeah, I show speed as a fucking idiot. Preview stream for what? Let me know. I'm going to go grab something to drink, people. I'll be right back. Let me pull up the banner. Actually, wait, no, fuck it. Who cares? I don't need a fucking sign. I'm just gonna go grab some drink. I'll be right back, people.
I forgot to oh, hold on, people. I'll be right back. It's like so funny. Um, can't lie. Oh my god, it's a little eclipse! Holy fucker! Oh my god, like... I just don't care, my G. I just don't care. Yo! What's up, Poppy? Yo, if Inter Milan bought all this league, they've finished out here, bro. And Pioli is gonna stay at AC Milan forever. He's gonna stay forever, bro. He going to stay forever. Crazy. Crazy, bro. Damn, Lee Gunner ain't live on his channel. It's crazy. Yeah, 34 likes. Get to 35. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 35, 35, 35. Yeah, I don't get the solar eclipse hype. I can't. I can't lie, bro. I literally just, yeah. Wow. David Okoye has had more touches of the ball than anybody, um, than any other Inter player. The other, than any, sorry, than any other Udinese player. Damn, yo, I, yo, I fuck with, um, I fuck with Tack. I fuck with Tack. I like watching his videos. I actually got to ask him. Filippo. That's that's his name, Filippo. Yeah, Filippo's 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 chill. I'm in a group chat with him about the USMNT. Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't care less about this clips, bro. But yeah, I like tactical manager TV, bro. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Why doesn't Doom why doesn't Doom Freeze block that though? Oh, I'll read bro, whenever. Whenever, like um what's it called? Whenever, man. The problem is, though, is that they go live on weeknights that I'm at work. You know what I'm saying? So. But, yeah, shout out Milan Weekly Pod, man. Love Milan Weekly Pod. Literally, I, I went to the Ecuador-Italy game. 
um, but yeah, people, it's half time here. Oh my god, the solar eclipse of the heart! Some 80s song, bro. One of our friends is like, oh my god, are you going to... Yeah, I do too. I do too. But the, actually, but then again, they're playing poorly today. They're playing very poorly. I expect far better of them. They're playing extremely poor. They've had like three decent chances, but... I think Udinese has also given them a good game. Like, they just pack in the midfield. It's literally a, like a 3-6-1. Um, but Nahuan Perez is doing really good on that right-hand side. And Wallace, I think, has been probably a man of the match contender. Um, Zaraga's doing a decent job sitting back as well. Wait, what? It ruins your eyes. I did okay, cool. All right. See, there you go. Instinctually, I don't care about it, and I don't care about it for a reason. Um Stuttgart beat Dortmund, yeah. Yeah, you see it without glasses. Did this thing already happen or what? Let me look out my window. I don't see shit, bro. I don't see shit. I'm close. I'm close to monetization. Very close. Yeah, shock staring at the sun hurts your eyes. Yeah. Yeah, I don't see shit though, bro. I looked out. Hey, fun fact, Square More. Fun fact. Um, did you know? Um What's it called? Um, I don't even remember what I was going to say. Who gives a fuck? To be honest. Do you think Lewis made another potch out video? What do you mean, do I think he did? Yeah, he did, he did. Yeah, that's why they fuck up their eyes. But yeah, Square More. Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to say. Hey, Square More. In addition to that, did you know that if you put your hand in a in a, in a, in a stove and it's on and it's turned on, that it's going to burn your fucking hand? Shock. Yep. Crazy, isn't it? Yeah, this eclipse thing, man. I just man. I know, right? No way. No way. Thanks for heads up. Yeah, no problem. No problem, bro. Nah, Lu to be fair, a lot of Chelsea fans 
Some of them got carried away, but then some of them were like, nah, we could fuck up here versus Sheffield United. You know what I'm saying? They were like, yeah. You know. So, some of them got cocky about it. Some of them got, uh, what's it called? Some of them got cocky about it. Some of them were humble about it. You know what I'm saying? Chelsea's just a mess. I believe AC Milan can beat their current team. Yeah, I agree with that. But then again, you guys lost to them last year, and they were arguably they were worse last year. <laughs> Excuse me. And then again, Graham Potter is a better manager than Poch. Better tactically as well. So I, I would probably favor AC Milan to beat Chelsea like 2 or 3 nothing. Probably. <laughs> I have no expectation... Bro, this Abigail movie looks fucked. A fuck, bro. Wait, you have to... That's stupid. Yeah, I ain't looking into that shit. Because of fuck. Anyways. Facts. That's a big upgrade, you know. Facts. Facts. Second half is kicked off, people. Udinese lead Inter Milan. one nothing. I think Inter will somehow do it because I don't think they can be this bad again, but I don't know. It's a weird one, isn't it? They were just way too fucking slow in that half. And Udinese's midfield, like I said, they, they've got five or six bodies. Like It was just too easy. It was too easy. Just too easy. Facts. Yeah, that's true. Now, now I've always been a fan of Ruben Loftus Cheek. Always. For years, bro. For years. Yeah, they made the semifinals last year. Yeah. Is that Gusto? The penalty for Alger versus Estac Trois. Alger currently top of Ligue 2. I'll probably get promoted right back to Ligue 1. Here's a chance here. DiMarco, ball in. Oh my god, it's a goal. 1-1. One, one. Go. That didn't last long. Oh. Wait.
They check in the goal. Did touch an Udinese player. Hmm. I can't lie. I can't. That's in it. They called it a goal, so there's no. I can't lie, bro. Like, hmm. That's offside. It doesn't touch an it doesn't touch an Udinese player. Yeah, that's offside. Yeah, Udinese is still one nothing up. Predictions for Champions League. Um, Arsenal two nothing. Over Byron Minchin, unfortunately. And um, two one Real Madrid. Two to one Real Madrid. Barella, poor pass, intercepted. Yeah, for Bi from Bayern perspective, bro, we're fucked. We don't have a fucking prayer. Havard. No, I think they do have a chance. I think they do. Bro, Dortmund have been excellent in the Champions League this year. I think they actually, they advanced against Atletico Madrid. I can't lie. Mikatarian. Havard. A Cherby. Turam. I haven't noticed Turam at all in this game, by the way. He's Federico Di Marco. Not Juan Perez. Samardzic. Free kick for Inter. DiMarco? Header? Nope. Wallace, good header. Cross, good block there from Ebizu. Uh, Eb uh, Jesus, Ebizwe, Ebizui. I some of the Nigerian names are tricky, isn't it?
They'll never sack Simeone. Sean Oglu? Otaro? Oh! Turam? Penalty. Penalty. Yeah, it's a penalty all day. Yeah, that's a penalty all day. He doesn't get the ball. It's a great ball, DeMarco. VAR is looking at it, though. All right, penalty. Yep, it's given. It's given. So Chala Nogla going to step up for this, probably. Because Lotaro Martinez sucks ass on penalties. Here's Hakan Chala Nogla. Hakan. Hakan. So I know, great penalty. He drills it left in the left corner. Excellent, phenomenal penalty. What a good strike from Hakan Chalanoglu, and it's 1 1. No, I just think you need to score two. Extremely good penalty. Like, that's got some power behind it, bro. Oof. Sean Ugly is a bad boy footballer, bro. Bad boy footballer. Unreal. Unreal. One one, people. One one. Damn. Good strike. Sean Ugly is automatic from the penalty spot, bro. Yeah, two one one people. So if Inter win this game and then the Cagliari game, and then they beat AC Milan, they could win the title. Three games away if they get another goal here. The Nera Atsuri. Perica Di Marco. Hakanchalanoglu. Nicola Barella. Barella gets shoved over a little bit. Okoye collects it, though, and plays it out quick to the right. Nicola Barella not having a good game so far, Bella Barella. He looks off it. He looks off it by far, bro. You don't look good today. Uh oh. Here's the inter on the break again. Lotaro Martinez. Good read. Good read. Very good read.
Enrico Di Marco. Cholanoglu. Carlos Augusto. Uh oh. Here's a chance. Try to put him in there. Nope. Easy for Summer to collect. Summer. Federico Di Marco. Cholinoglu. That's a bit of a poor pass, but Mikatarian does collect it on the left. Mikatarian. Lautaro Martinez. Mikatarian. Block. Beal. Offside on Inter. I'll be right back, people. Two seconds. Two seconds. And right back, people. Hey, we back, people. We back. We back. Doom freeze. It's a foul. PSG 2, Barcelona 2, and Atletico Madrid 2, nothing Dortmund. That's your predictions for Wednesday. Nah, I'm doing the I'm doing the watch. I'm doing the watch along with Jez from Arsenal the History and More. That's what I'm doing the watch along with, so doing a dual stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sean Ogle at Leverkusen was a monster, bro. And a Hamburg. Hamburg as well. DiMarco, Churam, no.
I haven't seen enough of Turam this match, bro. Inter just looked mad tired. I can't lie. Just look mad fucking tired. Ale Algeo. Hmm. Is the Cherby. Carlos Augusto. No subs yet from Inter. Francesco Acerbi. Cholanogu. Barella. Pick a pass, man. Pick a fucking pass. Augusto? Yeah, they are a bit relaxed. Oh my god! Camera! Camera! Cross! Tova! What a good defensive play from Inter. Mika Tarian bailing out a Cherby. Wow. That's a phenomenal tackle, Mkhitaryan. Wow. That was a great chance. That was a great, that was wonderful for Mkhitaryan. Wonderful defensive work. Damn. We got 25 minutes left, people. Still 1-1 between Udinese and Inter. Camera. Bio. Christensen. Bio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Facts. He had, he had to time that challenge perfectly. Udi Marco. Dumfries. Barella. Decent ball, but blocked out well there. Chalanoglu. Nope. Damn. So Everton are going to get relegated? I think so. Yes. Alger are up 2 nothing on Twa. Good finish. Is that Gideon Mensa? Who is that? No, it's uh Mikatarian off for Fratesi. Darmian on for Dumfries. Oh. Dumfries was terrible, bro.
Pereira. Oh, oh. That's close. That's close. I have no idea, to be honest. The whole points deduction thing for me, it's confusing. Good. Good. Fuck Everton. Barella? Chalanoglu? Barella? Barella. Go cross. Oh, Fratesi, that's so close. That's so close. Wow. No, I don't like Alberton. No. 15 shots, 4 on target for Inter. Tell an ugly. Pavard. Chalanoglu, good ball. Darmian. Happy Eclipse Day, yeah. Most people in... What? There's no way anybody seriously thinks that. That's crazy. It's nonsense. I'll be right back. Hold on.
Uh, sorry, guys, just starting some stuff out my room. Oh, TJ, yo, 16 out of 10 chair, but hey, 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 speaking of, yo, yo, you want a 16 out of, you want some 16 out of 10 chair, bro? Watch this, watch this, watch this. Hey, observe, observe my friend TJ Warren. Tova? Let's start By the way, it, can I just are. say, the two girls below us are looking 16 out of 10s today, both of them. Alright, okay. right, big up the panel, I told, as for... <laughs> you know what that is? Straight red, motherfucker. Bro said 16 out of 10. Shout out, shout out, shout out 16 out of 10 all day. Fratesi, no. Damn, they really gonna draw this game. Damn, my phone is cracked to shit on the back of it. Ouch. Oh, well. Yeah, big up, uh, big up, TJ. Bro, it is really, really funny. Wait, wait, what clip are you talking about? Hold on, what clip are you talking about? What's the funny clip? You wouldn't happen to be talking about um. A story. The, way, can I just say, the two girls below us are looking sixteen out of ten today, both of them. All right, big up the panel. I told as for uh, fuck my life. Yeah, it is really funny. Yeah, TJ, hold on. Let me anoint you. Hold on. It's never not funny. 16 out of 10 meeting, really? 8 out of 10? Bro, I don't know. Ryan Ryan doesn't even know why he said it. That's how stupid it was. That's how stupid he is. He just saying things that he don't even know the he don't even know why he's saying it. You know what I'm saying? Unbelievable, Jeff. Alright, TJ Warren, you have been. Anointed. Any UCL watch on? Yeah, for Byron Arsenal. Yeah. Then I'm on Sarcasm City. I'm gonna do um. um yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Both the girls got some crazy reactions, yo. Is Young Boys your Swiss team? Yeah, fuck with them. Fuck with BSC young boys. Why not? But yeah, you're right. You're right, bro. You're right, bro. You're right. I mean, look at look the at this. Story By the way, it, can I just are. say the two girls below us are looking 16 out of 10s today, both of them.
right. All right. Big up the panel. I told as for. Bro. Hey, thanks, man. Yeah, it's pretty nice, man. It's pretty nice. We chilling, bro. We chilling. It's a pretty nice shirt. Well, that's a good cross. Oh. But an essay close. But an essay are close here, you know. They were close. Still 11 minutes left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Facts. Barella, Nicola Barella, Di Marco, no, Wallace, 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 ooh, what stream is that clip off of? I don't know, to be honest. Yeah, Di Marco's off. Hey, speaking of what clip? Speaking of the clip, for those who don't know, story, by the way, can I just are. say the two girls below us are looking 16 out of 10s today, both of them. All right, okay. I big up the panel. I told as for Yan is still frozen to this very day. Fuck's sake. That's bad, bro. It's bad. It's so fucking funny, though. It is so fucking funny. Dude. Love is in the air. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 16 out of 10s are in the air, bro. Uh, Festi Ibosele is coming on, by the way. The Nigerian Irishman. Sandy Loveridge. He's hurt, bro. He can't. He could put barely any weight on both of his legs. Jesus. Tejan Buchanan on. Yep. He's playing on the left as well. April Sally going to play midfield. Interesting. Wow. Udinese have 112 passes. Inter have 500 something. I think it was 590 or something. Lunin over Kepa. Facts. Yeah, Kepa is. Nah, Kepa ain't, ain't that guy. He ain't that guy. Lexi Sanchez. Oh, Patensi, Buchanan has a shot. Oh, headed out, headed out. Shot by Pavard. Nope. Love said, anyways. Way more than half of his body over the offside. Yeah, yeah, I would have been offside, anyways. Damn, Sandy Lombridge, that sucks. Zamora? Tava? Who hasn't done anything in this game, to be honest? Lataro, Darmian, Darmian. Six minutes left here, people still 1 1. Lataro, Havad, headed out Tejan Buchanan. It's gonna be a corner. 
That's out. Joao Ferreira, one of the subs for Udinese. Eight corners to none. Tisha Buchanan. Buchanan strike gets blocked. A Cherby. Yo, that's crazy. The fact that I saw Tejan Buchanan playing from my local club, New England Revolution, and now he's playing for Inter Milan, you know. That's crazy. I've been well, I've been watching the guy for years, bro. I've been watching the guy for years. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. There's talent from everywhere. I watched a future Inter Milan player when he was like 18, 19 years old. Back. Yep. Remember that. For, oh, for a taxi? Barella? Barella? Tova? I'll try to intercept it. Augusto? Nope. Buchanan? What's up, Sub One? Pick up, Broski. Ooh. Burrell, great punch, Okoye. Great punch. Easy claim from McCoye. Easy. This is a great point. This is a great point for Inter. I can't lie. Or sorry. Udinese. Poor result, though. That is no. What's up, Keyshawn? Keyshawn, bro, was good. Pavard? Otaro? Yeah, it's a weird one, isn't it, Francisco? It's a weird, weird goal to concede. I agree with you completely, uh, Francisco.
Darmian. Christensen, good header. Zamora, bro, you got to clear that ball. Patetsi, wide. Wow. Seven minutes additional time, by the way. Hold up. Injury time. Hold up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Injury time plus seven people. What? They're not looking for a fucking replacement. Excuse me? Fucking garbage, man. Yellow card for Benjamin Pavard. So damn annoying. Milan drew at Napoli 1 1. They can win 3 0 away, but they can't beat them at home. How? They just weren't at the races, really. Inter against Napoli. No, Tuchel would be a terrible replacement. Yeah, yeah, I want Arnest Slot as well. Lazaro Martinez. Terrible pass. Ibosele draws a foul. Yellow. Yellow all dead. Kayeri. Um, wow. Inter Milan will be without Lautaro Martinez for the Cagliari game. They're losing their heads here a bit. No, they're both as shit as the other. They're both as shit as each other. They're both terrible managers who should not be at top clubs. Tuchel isn't even worthy of being a Borussia Dortmund manager. Barella. Sanchez. Darmian. 
Ooh. Ooh. Let's go, Martinez! Oh, it's two to one! Go! Go, 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 go! Into strike blood in the 95th minute! And it's two to one, Inter! Lautaro Martinez hits the post, but David Di Protese! He taps it in! That's his fifth league goal of the season for Davide Fratesi. It's 2-1 to one Inter late. Wow. 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 It was a good shot. It was a good shot and then an easy tap in. What did I say? I said 3-1 Inter win. There are a lot of Inter fans at the Blue Energy Stadium. A lot of Inter fans. There he is, Davide Fratesi. He's been a decent impact sub, you know. I feel for Udinese. They've played so well. They played well today, but they couldn't finish off the job, man. They fucked it. Uh oh, Joao Pereira, Perez. These are the two center backs in Inter Milan's half. Zamora. Oh, great clearance, Arnautovic. Good clearance. Inter fans are loving this. Yeah, people, no spoilers in the comments. <laughs> Damn, Nick. Hey, AC Milan, y'all can hold that. Juve, you can hold that. Y'all can hold that. I'm sorry. Wallace, Zamora, good, good one, good header, good header. Cleared out by Inter. Okoye, Christensen. Nah, Adam, it's all good. Yo, Adam, just next time, um, final Inter win. No, nah, Adam, it's all good. But, like, yeah, you could type it in after I react to it. It's all good. But, yeah, Inter 2-1 to one, come from behind win. That's crazy. Udinese are in big trouble here, you know. Yeah, they'll, be, they'll basically be champions, man. Look, big up everybody in the comments. Appreciate all the likes, subscribes, all that good stuff. Yeah, this Inter team, they didn't even play well today. Let's be honest. They didn't really play that well. Still got the job done. So, fair play. Their they're, uh, they're, they're mentality of the team is very, very strong. So, they're deserving winners of the Scudetto for sure. But, yeah. Anyways, take care, people. Peace out. Have a good one. Hit the like, subscribe. And, um, yeah, peace out. Hope y'all are good. Take care.